I think um, it's uh, good and then I'll turn the heat off and then we'll bring the pan back the, and then just add these on the top. So it looks so beautiful. After So friends, for our pulao, the celery, carrots, peas, onions, and peppers, pulao, the first thing we'll do is, I've heated up some olive oil, and then we'll add like a teaspoon of cumin, cumin seeds, and then after that, now I turn the heat to medium, I'll add some fennel seeds, the fennel seeds, bring out the flavor in the celery and then three green cardamoms and like a three three or four cloves and then friends after that i will add the celery so i've taken like uh, two stalks of celery and finely chopped it so we'll uh, saute this a little bit and then i will add some carrots so the, I can smell the fennel seeds, they smell amazing. Okay, and then I will add the carrots. So carrots take a long time. So what I did is I chopped them and microwaved them for four minutes. So they are pretty much cooked. So then we won't have to like uh, cook the vegetables a lot separately. And then We'll saute these a little bit. So carrots and celery go well together. They look colorful and smells good. And the next thing I'm going to add in this is the, a cup of frozen peas. You can take fresh peas, but um, I had frozen peas, so I'm taking that. So we'll saute these. Now I turned the heat back to high. So I have, when I was adding the spices, I turned it to medium so don't, don't burn the fennel seeds and the cumin seeds. But now I can uh, turn, turn it back to high. So we'll just cook these for a little bit. And we'll add salt as per taste. Um, so I took like two cups of rice, basmati rice, I have soaked them already and um, so for two cups of basmati rice and these vegetables maybe like two teaspoons of salt or like I'll add one and a half teaspoons and when I'm boiling the rice I'll just taste the water a little bit and then maybe add a little bit more. So I'll mix this a little bit. And the last ingredient in this, the vegetables part is the onions and it's a mix of different colored peppers and some un white onions. This will add to the color. Okay, and then now I will go ahead and add the rice in it. So um, I had soaked the basmati rice for like an hour, and these are two cups of basmati rice. The the vegetables also have some moisture in them, so. I will only add like 3 cups of water because I soaked it for a while so the, the rice already soaked some water so I'll add 2 more cups and 1 more cup Ooh. 
okay and so we'll boil these and as soon as they start to boil nicely I will cover them and then I'll turn the heat off so they look so pretty and then once the rice are cooked then we will just uh, do some tempering and add some dry fruits on the top okay so let's uh, let them boil okay friends so now the rice has started to boil we'll just cover this and I will turn the heat off so I have an electric burner it remains hot for a little bit so you can either turn the heat to low uh, I'm going to turn it off and then uh, I'll check it in like maybe 10 minutes and then after that we will do the tempering okay friends so it has been around 10 minutes since we covered it and turned the heat off so let's take a look so our rice is done so you can the way to test your rice is just uh, take a spoon or a fork and get some grains from the bottom and just uh, crush them and see if it is done so these this rice is cooked and see uh, this if you cook it with this technique you will see like the each grain is separate and um, it smells great now the, there is one more thing you can add to this pulao is uh, we can add some nuts so we can keep this on the side for a second and then take some take a pan and take some nuts and then oil add some oil in it and uh, just saute them a little bit and then we can just top up the pulao with these nuts so friends if you want you can use but butter or ghee so I'm using olive oil so olive oil like if you add on top of any rest any dish it's pretty healthy okay so I think um, it's uh, good and then I'll turn the heat off and then we'll bring the pan back the and then just add these on the top So it looks so beautiful after we add the nuts and it is smelling amazing. So friends this is the recipe for today. The celery, carrots, peas and peppers pulao. I hope you like the video. If you like the video like it, subscribe to the channel and don't forget to hit the bell icon. Okay friends so I'll see you in the next video. Till then bye bye.